We're like the superheroes. What superhero is coming for? The Fantastic, Fantastic Four. Four. The Fantastic Four. Fantastic. Oh, my God. Yeah. So top four, top four is exciting. But let's be honest, how that's happened. <laughs> and believe me, this one is going to be tough. Firstly, no more teams. You're on your own. Wow. No one to complain about, no one to bitch about. You only have yourself to blame for any mistakes. I want you to sell the impossible. Oh, God. Oh, my God, it's truck loads of oh, rubbish. Yes, yes, yes. It's rubbish. Kidding wow. me. Lemons! There's sand. Rose. 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 Yes, yes, yes. Tennis balls. balls. I'll take the balls. <sighs> I'm having those tennis balls. I'm looking at those tennis balls, and I'm just thinking, learn to juggle kids. It's just cash money for me. Pick your truck. And run. Really? <laughs> Ross and Josh take off. Let's be honest, if you were to put money on who's going to get there first, you'd probably pick him. <laughs> I just torn a quad. Oh. But I gave him a run for his money. <laughs> it was the first one here. And I'm really going to make it even tougher still. Now, I know what you've chosen, which is to think your easy way out. Yeah. Martha, go down there to the balls. No, no. Come on, get down there. Everybody else, move one step that way. You're kidding me. Didn't get the tennis balls. <laughs> Got a pile of sand. Yeah. But sand's good. Right, I am the sand man. Cool, cool, good show. What I'm loving about this is now I'm on my own and nobody's trying to sort of rein me in. So my plan is to have a sand emporium. I'm in my office, right? I'm here like that. Oh, no. Oh, business, business, business. And then I wander over here. Oh, what's this? Oh, I'm in the office beach. Oh, yeah, I feel like I'm... I feel like I'm at the beach, but I'm not at the beach. I'm in a small tree of sand, which I'm going to sell for $25. Yeah. Brilliant stuff that's really expensive. $500 scale model of the Sahara Desert. But you also have your low end. Something cheap. Uh, got it. Cars. Toot. And car. Moon. Sands. I can just do whatever I want. Who wouldn't want to buy cursed sand? Ross! You all right? Do you have any ideas for tennis balls? Don't think of them as tennis balls. But they are tennis balls. They're nice to look at. Ross, what's going on? It's pure business, that's what that is. It's very intense. What's happening? So, basically, I'm calling myself the Sandman, right? Um, so, for $250, I'm going to be selling a scale model of the Sahara Desert, right? OK. Um, I'm going to sell a private beach. Yeah. Um, exfoliation lotion. Yeah. Then, oh, this is the best bit of all, right? Yep. The cursed sand of Tutankhamun's tomb. So, what are you thinking? I'm thinking it's a lot. Right. There's a lot going on. Yeah. Too many ideas, too quirky and too creative. OK. There isn't about making, bring the cash in. Oh, don't you worry about that. OK. But, but the thing is, is that yeah. if one thing's not working, I'll just move to something else, right? The sound man is open for business. He's off. You're just the people that I want to see. So my strategy for selling is to not just about the product. Follow me, follow me. It's about a spectacle. I'm putting on a show. I am the Sandman. See my sand man. So basically, I have everything you could possibly want. High quality sand products, right? So we've got exfoliating balms, right? I've made these by hand. And uh, $25, you can go for one of the indoor beaches. And uh, this is one of the things that, uh, this is straight in from Egypt, just arrived off the plane. This is the cursed sand from the tomb of Tutankhamun. If you send that 
to your enemies, they will guaranteed to have havoc wreaked upon them. Level one is $10, $20 for level two, $30 for level three. I am the Sandman. And yes, I will bring you a dream, but mainly envelopes full of sand. I'll do it for 30, all up, $30. I'll give you a beach and one of them. Yes? All right, well, all right, no, brilliant. I thought you'd see sense on that one. Just got to put my glove on because it's uh, deeply cursed. Stand back. Level one cursed sand. Stand back, everybody. I still haven't won for my charity, so the idea of this is to just go hell for leather and sell, 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 sell. Come and join me. I am the sand man. Stand back, everyone. There is cursed sand here. Please keep the children back. Standing back. I'm, you know what? I'm, I'll put that in there for you. How much did you pay for sand? Uh, $30, $30, which is, is good. Is, is good. it? This is a replica of the Sahara Desert that I did myself. This, right now, is $250. Come on, can't see a fairer than that. Is it a deal? Yeah, it's a deal. Oh, my God, honestly, I cannot thank you enough. That is my big ticket item. Wow. Are you serious? That is quite heavy. No, come on, where's your car? Show me where the car is. Happy days. Whoop, whoop. Wow. How can he sell something for $250? That's ridiculous. Stand back, everybody. Stand back, please. The level three curse has been purchased. The most powerful of all the curses. Wow. First time come through. Don't think that that's just a blue container. You're at home there. You're in front of the TV. Ah. Oh, hang on, I'm on a beach. How is that possible? Yes, all right. $50, magnificent. I'll escort you out, all right? Because I don't want you to buy any lemonade. <laughs> $20 cursed sand. Please be careful with that cursed sand. Oh. Don't get it on any loved ones, whatever you do. Thank you. Incredible. Do you need a receipt? No. It's only for your enemies. Thank you very much. No more Mr. Nice Sand Man. Damn you to hell. Can you get your cursed sand off me? <laughs> the curse is upon you. Ross, over all the tasks, you've been a handyman, mm -hmm. a candy man, <laughs> and now you're a sandy man, right? Yeah. How do you think all this junk up? The cursed sand. Why would anybody buy a bit of sand? Because I was selling it in envelopes, mm. and it was all high, you know, had the hieroglyphics and Egyptian stuff on there, and there was different levels of curse. Right. Yeah, but I don't know. That's it. That's that's, that's that's criminal. Yeah. I made sure that I wore plastic gloves. When you buy a bottle of water and, and you go, oh, I'll, I'll spend a little bit more on that because it's got a it's got a picture of a, a beach on it or whatever it happens to be. Still, just water in a bottle. $30 for an envelope of sand. Get... Shane Ablaze, you know that's rubbish. Sorry. And the reason you know it's rubbish because he's got a label on it. The celebrity who is automatically going into the grand final is Ross. <laughs> Ross, congratulations, baby. Well, well you deserve it, Ross. At last, you've won something. Yes, money. Yeah.